Good morning guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 15. Oh my gosh, guys, how is it already Vlogmas Day 15? Anyway, I'm gonna open up today's little gift. Okay, so today is cotton rounds. Hey guys, it's been a while since I last vlogged. I think it's like three something. It's almost 3.30 and I'm just picking up my camera to vlog again. I think the last thing that I vlogged was opening that little gift this morning and then I didn't vlog anything else after that. Um, I've literally just been sitting on my floor doing stuff for my economics class all morning and this is a pen and all day basically and then my dad brought Panera home for lunch. That was nice. I could have vlogged that but I totally forgot. I really wanted to film a video today. I just did my makeup but I'm not really sure if I will have time to film it. I might just take the time to like mess around with my microphone that I bought a while ago that I still have yet to use on my channel because I just haven't really had much time to work on that. I've been doing a lot of stuff for school and work and things like that. I also have to Christmas shop and I'm going out tonight with my friend Abby and we're gonna go get some dinner and hang out. Maybe I'll ask her if she wants to go Christmas shopping with me so I don't have to do it alone but I don't really know if I'll vlog that. I'll have to see how she feels about being on camera. I don't really know like how she feels about that so I'll have to ask her and see if she's okay with that. Yeah that's pretty much all for now. I just got a package and it's from Victoria's Secret. I ordered a bunch of stuff. And you know what? This is probably super huge because I think I got a free robe. Anyway, let's... Why does my cheek look so red? Let's open it. So here's the free robe that I got. I picked the black one. It was like a really hot pink one. And then a black one too. So I went with the black one. Nice dressing gown. That's what they call it in like the UK. But it's a robe. I got like the cutest pajamas. I hope that these look good on me because like I didn't really know if this emerald green color it looks good with like my skin or my eyes i think it would have been cute it would have been it would have been cuter if it was like a blush pink color but they didn't have that and i found the cutest ones that had little cactuses all over them with like santa hats on the cactuses but of course when i go to buy it they were all sold out of like the top or something and I wasn't about to get a mismatch bottom and top so I just went with this one and I didn't want red because I wore red last year for Christmas so these are the bottoms and they're almost like a legging type thing and then they tie at the top and then this is the top that goes with it here's the top I got a small I think in both the top and the bottom so yeah we'll have to see if they actually fit I feel like this is gonna be kind of tight like my shoulders are really broad so I should have probably got a medium in the top and then I just got a bunch of underwear which I'm not gonna show you because that's just weird bought some underwear too so that's good that's my little Victoria's Secret haul and I really want to try on these pajamas now, so I'm going to do that. Here are the pajamas. So I actually just tucked the shirt in um, in the front because I thought that it looked better. It looked weird like with the little ties like sticking out. But yeah, there's the pajamas. I just have on this like really bright orange sports bra underneath, so don't mind that. But they're really cute. I think the small fits really good in both the top and the bottoms. So I think that was a good choice. And they're really cute and I like them. And they're pretty comfortable so that'll be cute for Christmas. And it's all matchy and stuff. So yeah, I think I like these a lot. They're a little bit short like on my ankles. I don't know if they're supposed to be or not supposed to be but I have really long legs. That's the only thing that I'm noticing is that they're like a little bit short on my ankles because or on my legs because my legs are really long so they don't like go all the way down but I'm not sure if they're supposed to or not so that's okay they're cute anyway and I'm gonna keep them okay guys so I just got ready and I'm about to leave to go pick up my friend Abby and we're gonna go get sushi and David okay. is in here talking to my dog this looks like a hot dog <laughs> so I'm wearing that pink sweater again that I wore the other day from American Eagle <laughs> Because it's so cute and I love it and I have to leave very soon, like right now. But I'm trying to charge my phone. Oh crap, I have to upload a video. I'm going to go upload a video. It's my how I edit my Instagram pictures. So go watch that. I'll link it down below. Looks like I didn't even leave yet because I'm in the exact same spot I was in before I left. And yes, I have hair. It's just in a ponytail. But I just got back from actually getting sushi with my friend Abby. I did leave. I did get sushi. It was very good. I just didn't vlog there because I actually kind of forgot halfway through. And then I remembered that I had my camera, but I didn't really like 
pulling it out because we had already eaten a bunch of the sushi and I just didn't feel like vlogging there guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know I'm failing at vlogmas, but I just didn't feel like vlogging there. I didn't really want to vlog our whole conversation. That'd be kind of weird. But anyway, the sushi was super good. I think my mom and my dad and me are going to probably watch a movie tonight or something like that. I don't really know. My brother's out seeing Star Wars with his friends. I want to see it so bad, but I need to get like a group together to go see it with me. I really look bald when I have my hair back in a ponytail like this. I put on my little robe thingy that I got today from Victoria's Secret. It's so soft, like literally so soft, guys. I love it and it's so cozy and warm and I'm like literally freezing like my toes are so cold right now probably because I wore Converse and it snowed and I wore Converse in the snow. That was a really bad decision but that's okay because they looked cute with my outfit. But yeah my feet are cold and I'm just really like cold and my hands are freezing. My hands are always cold guys but like right now they're really freezing and my hands look pink compared to my face. Like my face looks really yellow. What the heck? Do you see that? That's weird. Um anyway i need to get warm because i don't like being cold guys look how cute the tree looks in the background oh i love christmas i'm just rambling guys look at the snow it didn't snow very much but it did snow a little bit and it looks really cute there's our hot tub all snowy we got in the hot tub last night it was so freezing i think it's colder tonight though than it was last night but uh so cold outside so at youth the other night i made this super cute little ornament and it was supposed to like be a snowflake but I don't really know if it turned out that well but it is like handmade and everything on a little piece of wood and it's really cute and I feel like even though it doesn't really match my tree very well I feel like it'll still look cute so I'm still gonna hang it on my tree right there that's where it's gonna go yeah that looks no I don't like it there <laughs> it needs to go somewhere else like maybe right here or like right there is that cute I can't tell because there's a little ornament behind it so it doesn't really work. Also guys, I finally put a star on my tree. I decided not to buy a new one and I just went with the one that I used last year. I think it still looks really cute like that so we're just going to keep that star. Plus it goes with like the gold garland that I have on my tree so. Okay guys, so I'm going to do today's little devotion thing. Let me turn on my tree. Yay! So Christmassy. So I read in Luke 4 today for my word time in this morning and I wrote down a few of the different scriptures but after reading the scriptures I wrote down a little paragraph of what I felt God was mostly talking to me about through the scripture so I'm just going to read this to you and it says Jesus had the authority and has the authority and power to speak and see things be done. As a child of God with Christ on the inside of us we have that same authority and power that when we speak the name of Jesus by and in faith Every bad and evil thing must flee and bow to the name of Jesus. The devil has no place where Jesus is, and when you call on his name, he answers and he comes to you. So Luke 4, like the first part of it was about Jesus being tempted for 40 days by the devil, by the enemy, whatever you want to call it. Um, and how he fasted those 40 days as well, and so when he spoke things out, then they were done in the scripture. And that you see throughout the whole Bible where God speaks and things are done, like in Genesis when he spoke, let there be light, and the light came to be. So anyway, I just really thought that that was super amazing and just, I already knew that we have the power as followers of Christ to speak the name of Jesus and evil and bad things must flee, but it was just kind of like an eye-opening, re-eye-opening thing to me today that like you can go and pray for someone and when you speak the name of Jesus and you pray in faith and do it by faith, then things are going to happen, miracles are going to happen, you're going to see stuff manifest. So just go and pray for people and see things manifest, see them get healed right in front of your eyes by God through you and just speak words of faith and life and speak the name of Jesus and everything bad and evil must flee from it and bow down to the name of Jesus because there's no name higher than the name of Jesus. So that's pretty much it for the little devotion today. So I hope that that was encouraging for you guys and maybe eye-opening or re-eye-opening to you just like it was for me this morning when I, or this afternoon when I read the Bible. Yeah, I'm really not sure what my next vlogs are gonna consist of. I feel like I do a lot of the same stuff every day. So like I wake up, I have breakfast, I do school stuff, I go to work, I go to the gym. I feel like that's all I do really. But I'm hoping that the vlogs will get a little bit better closer to Christmas. It's so, so close to Christmas. Like it's literally the 15th and Christmas is the 25th. Guys, that's like, that's like 10 days, right? 
Am I good at math? That's literally 10 days, guys. I don't even have my Christmas presents. I need to go get Christmas presents. I have one Christmas present. That's the only thing that I have, and I need to get many more presents for people. Should probably do that. That will be a vlog. I will vlog getting Christmas presents, hopefully. But yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this vlog. Make sure that you subscribe and click the bell so you don't miss out on any upcoming vlogs in the near, near future. So like tomorrow and the next day and the rest of December. But yeah, thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it and go out, pray for people, see things happen, speak the name of Jesus in and by faith and just see miracles happen and manifest because it's so, so amazing. But yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.